In this video, let's talk about what does game mode do on iPhone. Let's get into it. First of all, game mode is only part of the iOS 18. So if you don't have that version, I encourage you to update. And the game mode is basically another form of the previously existing focus mode. So focus mode like the do not disturb mode, personal focus, sleep focus, and many more are part of your focus settings and one of them is the, the gaming so what it basically does is that it optimizes the using or the functions of the iphone for the optimal playing experience it means that it is going to silence some of your notifications you can customize it of course it's going to silence some apps it will uh, ensure that your game is the enjoyed the best with features like ensuring that your AirPods are set to low latency, which is a great feature, especially for gaming where you need to be directly there. No delay can be tolerated when playing a game. So this is another setting which is automatically switched when you go to the game mode. You also uh, manage the background apps a little bit differently on that mode because while some background apps like Apple Music and Spotify can remain active, others will shut down to allocate more resources to the game, which is useful, right? Because we have our chip, the CPU, GPU inside of our phones, and we want to use the maximum amount of them for our gaming experience and not some background uh, app activity. So this is all of the things which the game mode actually manages. But you can also just tweak them if you want. As I said, in the settings, in the focus mode, you can find the gaming focus and essentially switch on the notification silencing for specific apps or people. You might only allow some selected apps to be able to give you notifications. So plenty of different things which you can customize. There is also the wireless controller activation, meaning that if you control your games with a controller after pairing, your uh, iPhone will have the game mode turn on automatically. There's also the smart activation, meaning that it will again likely get triggered when you open up and start playing a game. So more settings to play with, but this is essentially what it does. Let me know below in the comments if you've been using it before or if you have any more questions about it. I probably will make an updated video about it if there are some more questions. So go ahead and do that. Subscribe to this channel for more videos like this one and I'll see you in the future. <laughs>